I'm back at you with another quick hit. This lesson, listen, listen. I'm not an individual that would just stay in one place. Oh, just five minutes, bro. We put our all into this truth. We need to study. We need to pray. We need to invest in this truth. Okay. This lesson is going to be based on, yes, we have to do it. Something called narcissism. Right. They were hoping you would never find out about this term. Narcissism, right? Narcissist. They need to control something, someone, somebody, something. You do know the people that are in power within the society, they have narcissistic personality traits. Right? The people that run the society have narcissistic personality traits. What's a narcissist? A narcissist is someone that seeks control power domination where does it come from it comes from the spirit of jezebel in the name and spirit and power of yahawashai we break we bind we cut up that cord of jezebel control manipulation we cut it in the name of yahawashai we bind it we break it it will have no power over us in the name and spirit and power of yahawah by sham yahawashai bahasham waha Laka, kwadash now, according to the scriptures, right? According to the scriptures, right? We're only going to do what Yahawashai wants us to do. We're not going to do what man wants us to do. We're only going to do what Yahawashai wants us to do. Mm? Bro, you're going to find out society is ran by psychopaths. If you truly have power, we're going to let the scriptures come out. If you truly have power, listen, you don't need to try to control someone. If you truly have power, you don't need to do that. Because if you have power, if you have authority, that comes naturally. That comes naturally. You don't need, to, the Lord gives you that naturally. People will be drawn to you. People want to do what you say because you have it naturally. Narcissists don't have it naturally. It's based on a false agenda, false um, appearance of who they are. Right? Got to understand that. So let's start from Timothy. Some of the traits of these um, individuals. First Timothy's. Jump straight to verse. Mm. Go into this, Baba Kishore. It says, right? Check this out. For men shall be lovers of their own selves. Covetous. So they have all these traits as well. Narcissists, they have all these different traits. Lovers of their own selves. These people love their selves more. They're flipping selfish, man. Selfish. Right? Lovers of themselves. Okay? And it says, covetous. So these people... Are, these people they're very, very, very covetous. They want what somebody else has. These are the traits of a of a narcissist. Right? And it says, Baba Kisha, boast is proud, blasphemous. So these people, they boast, they're blasphemous, and they're very flipping proud. Right? It's always about them. Right? They always talk about themselves. They always they always self-gloat. Right? And it says, Baba Kisha, disobedient to parents, unthankful, without natural affection. They don't have natural affection. Remember, it's all about themselves. Everything they do, it's all about themselves, 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 without natural affection. Right? Truce breakers. Bro, they can't keep promises. Right? Narcissists, guess what? They turn on each other quick. Right? False accusers, incontinent. And it says, first despises of those that are good. So, when you have a narcissist, they will be a despiser of those that are doing good. Don't ever let a narcissist catch you doing good. The moment they see you do it, bro, they want to mess that all up. Bro, I'm telling you, bro. You have to be wise the way we operate. Remember, their whole reality, their whole reality is based upon something that's not real. It's, it's a make-believe personality right it's a sales pitch that's what not 
everything the narcissist do is it's, it's, it's not real. It's not real. It's based off a false image, what they want, what they want other people to see about themselves. It's not really them. They have multiple personalities depending on who they're meeting. So say if they got many friends, right? They can change that personality according to the person they're meeting. Right? So, in other words, they have many demons. Right? And these people, bro, there's different levels to it. There's different levels to this. Different levels. Right? These people are psychopaths. Some say sociopaths. I call them psychopaths. Right? They hate to see other people happy. Right? Okay. We'll bring out these traits, bro. Wait me just a minute. What else have we got? Go to Proverbs. Alright. I don't know, because I've had my fair share of narcissists. But then you wake up and be like, oh my gosh. You're around toxic ass people. You're around toxic. These are the most toxic individuals you ever come across. Narcissists. They're not happy, bro. They need outward validation. Alright. That's what they need. Alright. So now let's go to Proverbs, Baba Kisha. And they lack character as well. Alright. And if their false persona is threatened, they can get very, very aggressive. As soon as you find them, find them out, they get very they get very defensive. They're very defensive because they don't see everything they do is based on a lie. Everything. So when someone with the truth comes now, they hate that. These are people that they hate truth. <laughs> okay. So let's go to, where was we? Proverbs 14 and 6. In the wise man fear from departed from evil. If you're wise, that's what you're going to do. You're going to fear the Lord and depart from evil, all evil. Right? A wise man fear and departed from evil, but a full rage of him is confident. And they're known for raging. Narc rage. Why are they raging? Because everything about them is about control. Control, control, control. Manipulation, control. That's what they do. And you figure their tactics as well. You figure out their tactics. Okay? You figure out all their tactics, the things they do, the things they say. Right? And if they do have friends, guess what? They even, these are not even their real friends. That's how deep it goes. If they do have friends, these are not even their real friends. They 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 have um what do you call it? Sup it's something called supply. Right? They have something called supply. So people are just um a means to get by to them. They use people. That's what that's what they do. It's just they have supplies. <laughs> then then a lot of them supplies they lose. They run out of supplies. Okay, a lot of these people run out of supply. That's what it's, it's a supply of people, right? Because remember, these people, they feed on energy. They need people around them. <laughs> okay, they need people around them, right? To validate how they are. Okay, so it's not based on truth, anything the narcissist does it's not based on truth it's always based on a lie you study narcissism you'll find it out soon enough you'll find it out so that's why when we represent truth narcissists hate that they're anti-truth right they are anti-truth and like i say if you're happy they don't like that as well right baba kasha baba kasha Right. Oh yeah, and narcissists, another thing, another thing. We're highly into um new age practices, witchcraft, but because it deals with manipulation. Right? Okay, but what is what's manipulation? Manipulation is when you're manipulating, you're trying to manipulate a situation or an environment. That's what manipulation is. Okay. When you're manipulating a situation or and environment to fit your own selfish purposes okay but that won't work with the elect 
Okay. See what else we can get. We're going to shut off soon. All right. Be careful of these individuals, bro. Oh, yeah. Another thing is, um, say if you're flourishing, you're doing something good. These individuals will, they will actually follow, bro. This is how psychopathic they are. They will actually try to mess up what you got going. They will actually try to mess up what you've got going. Okay. Say if you're going somewhere, right? And they know. They try to find out where you're... Bro, I'm telling you, bro. Very immature. Immature individuals. Right? So now let's go to Ecclesiasticus. We're going to bring this out. Okay. Ecclesiasticus. And jump straight to verse. Oh, yeah. They, they bear a lot of grudges as well. Like, bro. Their character shit. Excuse my language. They don't even have any character. And also don't have any character. He doesn't have his um he doesn't have no individuality as well. Right? They have to be in a group. They can't be alone for too long because they self-destruct. Bro, I know now, I know about these type of people. Right? Narcissists are grown. Say if they're 30, say if they're 30, 40 years old. Right? But they're like children in a, in a, in a man's body. That's what they're like. Okay, check this out. Ecclesiastes 28 and jump straight to verse mm, one man bear hatred against another and does he seek pardon from the Lord so they also known for being very hateful but you seek pardon from the Lord right he that he that showeth no mercy to a man that is like himself right he that showeth no mercy to a man that is like himself right and it says Baba Kisha and have he asked forgiveness of his own sins? But you're asking for forgiveness. Right? If he that is flesh but flesh nourish hatred, and who will entreat for the pardon of his sins? But you expect for your, your sins to be pardoned. Hmm? Remember that end and let enmity cease. Remember corruption and death and abide in the commandments. Hmm? Remember the commandments and bear no malice to thy neighbor. Remember the commandments and bear no malice to thy neighbor. Remember the covenant of the highest. And wink at ignorance. Wink at it. Key thing. Wink at it. Alright. Abstain from strife and thou shalt diminish thy sins. Well, knots can't do that because they stir up strife. Right. And it says, for a furious man will kindle strife. A furious man will kindle strife. Kindle it. So he be looking a way to do that. Bro, this, this is the type of things these narcissists do. Um, Say you're doing something, right? You're not doing nothing wrong. They will go behind your back, right? And say if there's two other people. Oh, you know he's like this and he doesn't wash up and he doesn't do this and he don't do that. Yeah, did you did you hear about him? I've heard he um he likes to steal. I've heard he he's a liar. That's the type of things narcissists do. It's real wicked. It's real wicked, man. Right? Abstain from strife, thou should diminish thy sins. For a furious man will kindle strife. So you want to stay away from individuals like this far away. You got something good going there, try to mess it up, man. Right? And they act like bullies as well. And it says, A sinful man describes his friends and maketh debate among them that be at peace. A sinful man. So a man full of iniquity. Right? It says, Disquietive friends. Disquietive. Right? And maketh debate amongst them that are at peace. Key thing. Those that are at peace. Right? Disquietive them. So now you've got, amongst the brethren, you've got a lot of murmurings amongst the brethren. Okay. And it says, Baba Kisha, a sinful man describes friends and make of debate among them that be at peace. Amongst them that be at peace. So you have brothers that are at peace, but one wicked ass individual, right, causes a lot of skirmishes and things, man. And messes it up. Right? 
be careful of these narcissists, bro. They, bro, a narcissist will start us. A, a narcissist will start a slander campaign against you. Okay, that's what a narcissist will do. Start a slander campaign against you. Okay, out of nowhere. Okay, and it says Baba Kisha. A hasty. Hold on, hold on, hold on. As a matter of a fight is so is a burning, burneth, right? So is a fight as it burneth. As a man's strength is so is wrath. And according to his riches, his anger riseth. They're even more dangerous if they got riches, if they know people. Bro, I'm telling. The scriptures are telling you. The scriptures are telling you about these people, man. Stay far away from them. They'll try and mess up everything you've got. Everything you've got going. Everything. If you've got anything good going, they'll try to sabotage that. Mess it up. They gaslight. They manipulate. They lie. They do. They set up smear campaigns. M remember, they, do they know a lot of people? They know a lot of people because it's idiots that know other idiots. It's, it's, it's smear campaigns. Yeah, they do know a lot of people. Right? And they have something called flying monkeys. So if you ups if you upset the the head narcissist, they will call other narcissists, which are known as flying monkeys, to come after you and find out what you're doing. Or if you used to hang around with one, you stop hanging around with them. They will send other people that are like them. It's this is like a network. They also they build up a network, but the network is very untrust trustworthy. They don't trust each other. I'm telling you, bro. This this is deeper than you think. And it says, check this out. And a man's strength is so is his wrath. And according to his riches, his anger riseth. And the stronger they are, which contend, the more they will be inflamed. And a hasty contention kindle off a fight. And a hasty, hasty fight, it shedeth blood. If thou blow the spark, it shall burn. If thou spit upon it, it shall be quenched. And both these come out of the mouth. True. Stay away from gossip. Stay away from gossip. Man, we just... Didn't... You don't like you don't want to be gossiping, bruh. Curse the whisperer and a double tongue. Right? So make sure you're not whispering, make sure you don't have a double tongue. You're saying one thing to a brother when you see him, but behind your back you're saying something else. The Lord doesn't like that. The Lord Jehovah does not like rats. Alright? For such have destroyed many that were at peace. These people they I don't want to say they've mastered, but they're very cunning when it comes to forms of manipulation. They have destroyed many of them that were at peace. Right? Turning one person against another. It's like CIA tactics. And it says, And the backbiting tongue have disquieted many and driven them from nation to nation. Where they've had to flee from nation to nation. Right? Strong cities have been pulled down and overthrown. The houses of great men. And a backbiting tongue have cast out virtuous women and deprived them of their labours. Whoso hearken unto it shall never find rest. You hearken unto that deceitful voice, you're never going to find rest. Never. Hearken unto it, you shall never find rest. I can't stand that. That's why a lot of the times I'm by myself, I, don't, I can't stand gossip. I'll stay far away from that. If I hear gossip, I don't want to be around it. I'll stay as far away from that as possible. Because guess what? If someone can come to you and talk about someone else continually, if someone can do that, that means they're talking about you. That means they're talking about you. Be careful people that always do that. Complain to you about other people. Okay. And it says, Baba Kishore, check this out. Check this out, check this out, check this out. And it says, And hasty contention kindled for fire. And hasty fighting should have blood. Curse the whisper and a double tongue. And a backbiting tongue have cast out virtuous women and deprived them of their labours. Whoso hearken up unto it shall never find rest, never dwell quietly. Right? The stroke of a whip maketh marks and in the flesh, but the stroke of a tongue breaketh the bones. Be careful what you say as well, man. Right? Many have fallen by the edge of the sword. But not as many as have fallen by the tongue. Not as many that have fallen by the tongue. The scripture says, power, what's it? Life and death are in the power of your tongue. What you're saying. Right? A lot of power. Okay. So we went to that now, Baba Kishore. 
Many have fallen by the edge of the sword, but not as many as fallen by the tongue. Woe is he that is defended from it and have not passed through venom thereof, who have not drawn the yoke thereof, nor have been bound in her bands. So always be wise, use wisdom of how we're speaking, what we're saying, what we're doing. Stay away from the narcissist because they're going to bring you nothing but trouble, nothing but issues. That's all the narcissist is going to bring you. Nothing but issues, nothing but trouble. All right? Keep that in mind. Okay? So with this, I'm going to shut off here. And until the next time. Shalom, shalom.